Support the 8-Bit Bros by checking out the new Rotom G hoodies and shirts. Link is on the screen. Alright guys, this is Gameboy Luke here, and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Power Lock. In the previous episode, we defeated our dad in the gym battle. Unfortunately, we did lose a team member. We lost Lunatone or Crescent Lunatone, which I'm really disappointed about because I was really looking forward to losing, uh, to using, I'm not losing, using Crescent. Um, but unfortunately, we did lose him in the last episode due to a careless mistake by myself. Be sure to check out, definitely go check out that episode before this episode starts. But obviously, before this episode starts, you can go ahead and power up that like button, let it shine blue for the 8-bit bros. So I do appreciate the support on the series. And on the channel, um, and I did ask a question in the last episode. I asked you guys because we did obtain two new Pokemon. We up, we obtained one new Pokemon and grabbed the Pokemon from the box to replace Crescent with, um, and we picked up Geodude and we uh, have a Latias. Now I asked you guys, are you okay with me using the Latias? And obviously I haven't got the response yet because I haven't uploaded the uh, the video from yesterday. It hasn't actually gone up yet, uh, or the last episode. Sorry, hasn't gone up yet because I'm trying to record as many of these in bulk as I can. Because university and college is a thing, work is a thing, I'm just trying to get my videos out. I can't see a problem with it. Our team isn't exactly overpowered, and Latias would be a great addition to use, and I'm in looking forward to seeing what kind of moves it can learn at base power 60. We may even have to drop him off at some point, because he can't learn enough moves at base power or si base, base power 60. So, I don't know. I see no problem with it. But if you guys don't want really to use him, just, or her, sorry, uh, obviously, I'll pick that up in the comment section and you guys will just let me know. But I'm sure you guys are okay with it. I'm honestly um, more than confident that you guys are going to be okay with me using this Pokemon. But with that being said, I think we should go ahead and move on. We'll do a team recap, actually. So we've got our level 34, level 34 KFC, which I'm guessing is going to evolve, evolve this um, this episode because he's two levels away. We'll have Blaziken by then. RJ level 30, holding an escape rope for whatever reason. i have to pick that off you real quick. Mira B at level 31. Bruh, level 30, the Bloom. Um, and then we have Geodude, which is level 22, he was level 25, then we can just trade him between 2-3 DS and get a Golem, so that's always good. And then we have Mother Glare, with Heal Pulse, Dragon Breath, which are, these two moves here are both base power 60, so that's always good. We should find another move between these two, to teach it, and stuff. So, with that being said, I think we should go ahead and move on, I'm gonna leave KFC at front because I do want him to evolve this, uh, this episode, like I said. So let's go ahead and move on. I'm so used to playing X and Y, like by using the control stick, I'm like expecting the um The roller skates to come out. That's the worst word I was looking for. So I'm gonna run through this grass. We haven't actually got an encounter for this route yet, so. That's a dupes clause. That there is a mother trucking dupes clause because we already have a lot. I'm 12 levels higher than you and I can't run away. How much sense does that... Don't fuck with me, Lanoon. I'm 12 levels higher than you. I guess it's because i got a speed reducing nature. I think I've got a speed reducing nature, special attack increasing. Which isn't great, but... <laughs> what can you do? What can you do? But... What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this escape rope off. I just realized RJ is actually holding an item, and I really need an encounter for this route, because who knows what we can get here. Oh, you know what index have encounters we can get? There's an Electrike down there, and a Kecleon. I'm pretty sure, so we, we do need to get an encounter for this route, but... Bird Pokemon, that's not good. I'm trying to level up my, um, my Combuskin, and you're gonna be throwing all kinds of flying-type moves at Pelipper! Well, that's just mean. That's just mean. I mean, I could probably kill it. Let's go ahead and just kill it. Let's just kill it. I ain't a scare. I ain't scared. Oh, okay. I mean, that's okay. I guess, Pelipper, if you just want to sit there and protect and stuff, bruh. But I'm just going to sit here and rock tomb your ass. Ugh. Yo, why is this toilet so defensive? Payback. Oh, God. Yummy. Yeah, I mean, I mean uh, Pelipper has no physical attack whatsoever, so I'm going to rock tomb you again. Get a crit, get a crit, get a crit. Don't get a crit. We're gonna be here a while. Three hours later. Protect Roost Storm. Pelipper, I would love it for you if, if you could just stop it. Just for a second. Just for a sec. 
Alright, Pelipper, we're gonna have a few problems here. Because uh, right now, I'm just trying to progress in the game. And you're kind of standing... I'm standing in my way right now. I guess the only way I'm going to be able to kill you is by power-up punching. I bet he doesn't go for Roost now. I love Pelipper. But this shit. This is stupid. This is stupid as shit. All he's doing is Roost protecting. And now he's paybacking. Alright, watch him use watch him use protect now. Hey. You know what? I kind of understand why Poach Pelipper is a thing right now. Because this is dumb as fuck. Catch us get 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 out of here. Alright. Jesus Christ. All that effort to take down that Pelipper. Perry, you're a dick. You are a dick. And I do not mean that in the nicest way. I mean that in the I'm saying that in the meanest way possible. You are a dick. Shit. So we find the electric, which is all fine and dandy. We found an electric, sorry. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, power up punch you. Because I don't think that will kill you. Never mind, I killed it! Fuck. Could have done with an electric, actually. Whoops. <laughs> Okay, so let's carry on. Move on up. And we actually enter a new route here anyways, so... Not like it's a problem or anything. Let me just check my bag. Let me just check my bag. I'm running out of soup potions, but I got 11 hype potions. And I guess we're just gonna shimmy on through. Shimmy on through. Are we gonna find a Pokemon? <gasps> we didn't find a Pokemon. Does that mean we could go in the water and find something? Because I know you can get Feebas. Which is always good. He bats a fun Pokemon. Um, but then again. Oh, it's raining. That puts me at a straight disadvantage. Because my fire type moves are gone, aren't going to do shit. Uh, this is a neutral fight now. Force Bomb. Yummy. Yo, why is, why is Bloom so good? Bloom is way too good. I'm going to flame charge it just to get the speed increase. Oh, wait. Why do I need the speed? How did he attack me first last turn? How do you attack me for- <gasps> No! No! Combustion! He used counter! No! No! Balloon! Why? Oh my god. Are you serious? You are a fuck. Fuck Tropius. No! Oh. That's not fair. Counter Balloon. Oh, man. All right, fine. Fine. We need a fire type. <clears throat> Excuse me, fire type. I'm so pissed now. That's so stupid. That's so stupid. Oh, and it could all have been avoided. You just don't think about moves like counter. Uh, 
I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Look how bad this Latius is. This Latius is not going to be all that great. Get out of here. Damn. Damn. What do we do now? Fuck off, Tropius. Nobody wants your stupid ass. Are you serious? We lost the combust. I just thought I had my team, like, ready on deck. He was gonna... <laughs> He was going to be the savior, man. He was going to be that, that one Pokemon that just did everything, you know? That really sucks. That really, really sucks. Like, so badly sucks. <laughs> so, I guess with our starter gone... We're gonna have to catch like a fire type at Mount Pyre. Get like a Vulpix or a Growlithe. I do need to get the Surf Pokemon on my team real quick though. I need to put you on my team just so we got you. Cause I think I can get a Water Stone in a second. Man, that sucks so much ass. Oh well. Oh well. Whoopsie. <laughs> oh, that's killed my mood. Like, did not expect that coming to come, to, to happen, whatever you want to fucking call it. And now I've got a psychic type out again. I can't. I need a f uh... Shit. So, <sighs> next best thing we can get is a Growlithe. But well, the best thing about- the worst thing about that is- Are you serious? Can you stop using stupid moves like Swagger? Come on. I don't want to see that shit. I really don't. This is so stupid. This is so stupid. The problem with this Growlithe, he doesn't have any f base 60 power moves at all. Maybe, I don't know if Flame was, I think that Flame was like 65. Am I Quick Claw just activated? Oh, I'm gonna hit myself with the confusion again. Hey, thank you. Get out of here. <sighs> Who's next? Mira B wants to learn Uproar. What base power is it? 90, can't learn it. Nope. <sighs> okay, who's next? Go back. Okay, I need to get out of here. Uh, Go back is a fuck. Like, that Pokemon is not easy to get past. I feel like I can send you in. I feel like I can send you in. I'm gonna put my faith in my in my Geodude right now. And for those of you that came out to the stream that me and Nappy did on Sunday, uh, you all you all know the power of uh, of Golem. I'm just putting it out there. Golem is a motherfucker. I love him. Poison Fang. That's not very effective against me. I will take. What the fuck? I did nothing. Grant need to get the poison. That's half health. I'll take it. I might be faster than you now. I might be able to destroy you with a rock tomb real quick. Come on, Gia, dude. Okay, he's gonna use another poison fang. That's fine. Catch this rock tomb. Yeah! Gia, dude is so good. I love this. I love this Pokemon. It's so generic, but it works so well. He wants to self destruct. No. No, thank you. I would have very much appreciated it if you didn't learn that move. Best way to heal Pokemon up right now is to uh, 
do the old sneaky sneaky and just do this and just go box you for unbox you for box you put you back on here like that all healed do 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 because when you box a pokemon they automatically get their health back so it's always a thing i'm gonna leave rock in first position because i honestly i'm gonna battle this trainer over here as well just because um, he may gain a level just from fighting this guy, and we'll be able to get a Graveler, and I'm gonna get my second 3DS ready. I'm gonna get my second 3DS ready, because we is about to trade. We is about to- oh wait, actually I don't know if I'll evolve. It's only a- it's only a Grimer. Actually, he's six levels higher than me. Catch his bulldoze, motherfucker. Catch his bulldoze! Don't poison me again. Thank you. And now I'm faster. Hey, Jiridu coming through. Come on. Come on. Nope, it's not enough. It's not enough. I got too, um... I got too keen. I got way too keen. I'll load my second game up anyways, just so it's there and ready to go. Leave him here. And what we can do is we can not sit down. <laughs> is continue on through here. Um, oh god. What's going on? Could it be? Is this the world Archie hoped to create? Cursed you! To get the precious results of my research! Give them back! Shut your mouth! Oh my god. Uh, steady on, are you alright? <laughs> Fine, I'll give it back, I'll give it back, alright? The awakening of the super ancient Pokemon will bring out extreme weather. If it happened, to, if it happened all over the world, what would people... What would become of people? Of Pokemon? Not not to mention people. Jesus Christ, just speaking such weird methods. Methods. I'm good to go. How do I go you have? You have two. Uh... Problem is with this guy is I honestly wish. Do you know what I might do? I know it's kind of bad, but I want to trade myself an ability capsule to give my um, Geodude sturdy. Um, but he's gonna aqua jet me for sure. So I'm gonna switch into mirror B mm -mm. Would that count as cheating because I really want sturdy on this thing instead of rockhead because rockhead's not gonna do all that much for me because any um, Any moves that do uh, recoil damage are like over like a way over base power 60. So what's the point? Slap Get out of here Get ha L L Lombre doesn't give a shit. All right. I'm just saying Lombre is out here Not giving two fucks and the rock grew level 25. <gasps> it's happening. It's happening. And the next Pokemon might- Yeah, I'm gonna stay in. Actually, am I gonna be fast enough? I right, never mind. He intimidated me. I was gonna say, I'm gonna stay in and destroy this thing, but never mind. Never mind. I'm gonna go out in the bro. If you swagger me, I swear to God. If you swagger me, I swear full God. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna force palm you. Am I faster? Doesn't matter. I got the quick claw. Bop. Yeah. Swag. I'm gonna bend the rules. Um. Wait. What is this? Base sixty? Please be sixty. Seventy. Keep old moves. Yeah, I'm gonna bend the rules. I want Sturdy on my Graveler, because you already know that'd be so useful. And after losing Combuskin, definitely going to be helpful for us. So, I'm going to trade this Graveler over to the game. Get him on there. Ability capture him to Sturdy. Trade him back. Just because Rockhead is not going to help us in any way, shape, or form. So, we have a Graveler. We have a Graveler. We have a Graveler, people. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the PSS. And at the bottom... I've never used the PSS. Wow. Okay. There's a passerby. Hey. Judge trade Pokemon? Here we go. Cool. And I'm actually in the team right now. 
I have the poke one I was using from the Wi-Fi battle last night, so let me just trade myself real quick. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Alright, so communicating, please stand by. Alright, so I have now received the golem. Obviously there was no evolution screen because the evolution screen happened on the other 3DS. But uh, there we go. I now have uh, now have my golem. And I did ability capsule it. I thought I'd cut out like the trade, actual trade thing itself because we would have been here forever. Like for like a clean five minutes just waiting for that to happen. So that's why I skipped past it all. It's all done. So we can now quit trading. And I can turn this 3DS off. So all done. I'm waiting. I don't know why I'm waiting. 3DS. Can, can, can we continue our playthrough? Or or nah? <laughs> okay. Alright, cool. So there we go. We have uh we have our golem of 25. Let's see the stats now. We have 49 and 45 defense. So he's got 72 attack and 67 defense now. Which is marvelous. He's definitely a freaking killing machine now, which is what I like to see. Plus he has 30, so we got nothing to worry about anymore. Nothing to worry about anymore. I feel a lot more safer, I guess you could say. I ain't scared to get, I'm gonna get destroyed by a counter when I'm at full health, so it's fine. He's gonna send in this gold bat. We only did like half health to it last time, so let's see how much we can do now with freaking the rock Kelsier. Let's see this. Let's go. Poison Fang. Oh god. Oh no, my sturdy. Rah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, bruh. Let's go. Uh, I reduce his speed and he's still faster because Golbat is way too quick. Way too quick. And I'm trying to destroy like that. There we go. I love this guy. I love Golem. I don't know what it is, but I really like Golem. I really like him. And all his moves are base power 60. He's got a whole move pool full of moves that are just base power 60. Which I really, really appreciate. And I'm gonna high potion just so he's at full HP, just so we have the uh, we have the sturdy. I feel scared of nothing, but oh my! Wait, wait. I even run into you when I'm not on the clock. I wonder why that is. Maybe we're just destined to be together. <laughs> Want to know something? Uh, I'm feeling so empty and down right now. I can't get my head straight. Um, help me take my mind off of it. The way you and your Pokemon battle so straightforwardly and sincerely with such hope, it makes me so mad. Better kick your ass, girly. Better kick your ass, girly. Swear for God, you're gonna bring out Sharpedo? I ain't scared of your Sharpedo. I just wanna put that out there. I'm not scared. I have Sturdy. I have Sturdy now. So that means I can power up punch you in the, in the nose. Ice Fang! Alright, go ahead. I'm gonna eat that up. No, we actually ate that up. I'm so impressed. It's a power punch. Blip, 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 blip. Oh, the rough skin. Oh my goodness, that could have fucked me up. Okay, I'm, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna heal up. I wanna see if she goes for like a stat reducing move. Or. Oh, there's no fun of the ice fang. Okay, fine, I'll switch out. Fine, if you're gonna be like that. <gasps> it's a crit, it's a crit, it's a crit. Stop it. No, it's not. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here. Um. Who do I go to for this? Oh, uh, my team is so hard to use right now. RJ? Question mark? I'm gonna go into you. You're gonna ice fang me. How much is that gonna do? Okay, I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it. Uh, and then I'm gonna pin missile. Am I faster? I am faster. <laughs> Let's go. Wow. Come on, twice? And a scary face me? Alright, okay. Trying to intimidate me and shit. I'm just gonna throw, throw another pin missile at your ass. Slash! Oh god, that was a crit. Jesus Christ. Luckily though, you are now taken care of. And Linoon actually has a lot of HP for whatever reason, but thank you. And goodbye. 1104, and the rock gained a level. Yeah. 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 Alright, cool. Ha! <laughs> that tied me out. I'm sure it did. I'm sure it did. 
Hmm, uh, I feel a bit more relaxed, so thank you. As a token of my gratitude, I'll tell you one thing. When Team Aqua's, no, when the illustrious Archie's ambitions have been realized, the world will truly return to its beginnings to afford the birth of anything at all. Think, uh, think for yourself about uh, what to do when you're up against that reality. I still haven't figured out what my for myself what's wrong and what's right. See ya. I'm sure I'll run into you again, though. She has a crush on me. Archie is probably on the way to Mount Pyre, so I... Mm hmm. So I guess we made a good pound made Ponyo. Thank you, young one. You saved us from uh, you helped save us from quite a pinch. You okay? <laughs> I'm gonna do an Australian accent for this guy, because he has mate at the end of his fucking sentence. You okay then, mate? I, 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 I was truly really a slap in the face. Those thieves. Uh, what could what could they hope to gain by investigating the extreme weather patterns of those thousands of years ago? Oh, but I'm forgetting myself. First, I must thank you properly for your help. It might seem an odd way of rewarding you, but please send this Pokemon as my thanks. Question point. You cannot carry any more Pokemon with you currently. Why don't you call, come to call again once you've made space in your team? But as for those, uh, for the data those ruffians are seeking, they want to know about all the extreme weather conditions that ruled thousands of years ago because of those two super ancient Pokemon. One of the pair of the legendary Pokemon we know is the mighty Kyogre. By absorbing the energy that abounds in the natural world, Kyogre transformed itself, or so it said. The transformed Kyogre caused it so much disturbance that the weather, to the weather patterns that it, to the world was assaulted by to, to the weather patterns that the world was assaulted by torrential rains and the seas rose around the planet. We refer to this transformation as primal reversion. It's the, its result in terror we call primal Kyogre. Primal reversion is possible form of evolution like and yet not like Mega Evolution, or so it's been theorized, but it has never been achieved by any poke any Pokemon other than the super ancient legendary Pokemon, and so it is largely forgotten about as a method of evolution. Uh, if you'll excuse us then, we'll be heading downstairs now, and talk but talk to us when you have a moment. We want to thank you as well. Jesus, so the super ancient legendary Pokemon is kind of like a huge ass tongue twister that and means like it's like a soup it's like a it's like a form. Oh, I might. We've we've been saved by your actions, but what I don't understand is what what on earth Team Aqua was up to. Is that right, mate? That's some good information. I'm just gonna lay in bed, even though I just realised I actually tried to heal my Pokemon up through the Pokemon PC. Now I would pick up. You know what? I think I am gonna pick up the cast form because you know what, mate? He definitely is holding a Mystic Water, and a Mystic Water is definitely gonna help us out with the moves on our on our Lombre, especially when we get uh, Water Pulse. My Australian accent isn't as great as great as Grant's, but I'm here to entertain, and I hope you enjoy the accent. I'm definitely gonna talk to you right now and receive the cast form, which is fantastic, mate. This is a gift Pokemon, so I could potentially use it on my team, but I am not gonna use it. I'm not gonna use a cast form. Cast form's terrible. I remember I tried to use it once for fun in my team, and it was just such a pain in the ass because it's only really good if you get the weather condition up, and even then, it's not all that great. But the only reason I wanted it was because of the Wistic Water, so... He does look cute though, look at him. And what I can now do... Uh, it's because I obviously, uh, I want to get... Water Poles for Mirabi. When that time arises, you know, it's going to be useful to him. So, yes. But for now... I think we're going to leave. And we may even potentially have a, a uh, another evolution right here, because I'm going to shimmy down this way. Avoid May, because I know May is over there. And it's raining right now, so I'm gonna jump in the water. I don't remember if I have repels. Uh, I do. Okay, because I'm gonna go down here. I wanna show you something. I don't know if anyone know knows about this. And I'm not sure what we get. Wait, no, 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 no. This isn't where I wanted to go. I wasn't ready to jump off here. Alright. Alright. Cool. Oh, it's a leaf stone. It's not a water stone. Yes, you can get a leaf stone here. I thought it was a water stone. I thought we could use said water stone on Lombre. But apparently not. I'll have to find out now where the hell to get a water stone. Give me one second. I think I already looked this up in previous episodes. Um... That's really annoying. Like, really irritating. We can get one from Route 106, Route 124, or Super Training. 
Which is fantastic. Route 106. Route 124. Route 106. We need surf for it. Actually, we might be able to get that. We might be able to get that. Okay, cool. Luke! Oh gosh, where have you been hiding? I've been looking all over for you. Question point. Oh, where did you get that thing on your wrist? That's a pretty fancy looking bracelet. Wow, so that's a mega bracelet. And you can use it for mega evolution? I guess you can keep getting even closer to your Pokemon, huh? Some guys have all the luck. But I'm not about to lose to you in some accessory. Let's see who's best in a battle. Are you Pokemon already? Of course they are. Let's go. Mm. Alright. So, the Water Stone. Why is it jumping? Stop it. I'm gonna close these windows. Right, okay, cool. So we got a shroomish real quick. Um, I could stay in on you. I don't know if I'm faster. Uh, I am gonna survive your hit, so it's fine. I'm gonna power up punch you, see how much damage that does. Not a lot. But he's gonna poison me, so that means I can't stay in now because Sturdy is broken. Sturdy is broken now. You know what sucks? That we don't have a flying type Pokemon. I mean, um, a fire type Pokemon anymore. Um, I want to see what Mega Latius gets it, its boosted stats in. Worry Seed. That's fine. That's fine. Yes, it is. Aerial Lace into the face. Alright, so look. Um, Megalatius gets boosts in its physical attack by 20, so it does benefit us. Yeah. Yeah, let's go, Mother Glare. Bop. There we go, that's what I want to see. Effect Spore. God damn it. Fucking Effect Spore. Okay, who's next? Blip, blip, blip. Who's next? Who's next? Who's next? Who's next? Next is the Slugma, which we can go into a water Pokemon for. Even though I have no water moves on him. If we use Nature Power, is it going to use a water type move? Because it's currently raining right now. I kind of want to test it out. Okay, let's go. I'm going to use Nature Power and I'm expecting Surf. Energy Ball. God damn it. Okay. Yeah, that does a lot. That did a lot considering. And like using uh, Nature Power is like a way of bypassing the Power Lock rules because this move... Because technically Nature Power has a base power of nothing. So I can go ahead and use Nature Power. Nature Power is my way of bypassing the Power Lock rules. It's a little sneaky sneaky, if I'm honest with you. Um, and even though I don't actually have a grass type move, I can use nature power right now to finish this Pokemon off because I'm using energy ball. Oh god, bide. We better kill this thing in one hit. Bleh. Alright, good. Swag! That's a thousand experience to me. Rogue grew level 27. Jello grew level 16. Did I try to learn water pots? I mean, I'll teach it to you just because um, we may want to use you later on just in case. Oh yeah, so get rid of uh, get rid of constrict for that. There you go. There we go. Ha! Ah, you're as strong as I expected, Lugie. Of course. Of course. Hmm. Well, you did battle me like I asked, so I'll give you a reward. Hey, we got Fly, which we're not even gonna use because I'm waiting for, to get the Eon Flute. If you use Fly, your Pokemon will carry you back to some place you've been to before, where you need to beat the gym and stuff like that. I'm gonna see you. Bye. Great chat. Wait, great talk. Wait, great talk. Great talk, dude. Okay. So what I might do in between episodes is attempt to find the, uh, the water stone because I really do want it. And I don't think we have the Eon Flute yet, so we can't use the Eon Flute to fly around. Excuse me. So I have to bear without flying places uh, for now. I'm guessing we get it after we beat the gym leader because that would make sense. We could actually fly once we've without using HM Fly. She lets us fly, so I don't know. But I think I'm going to end this episode off here because in the next episode, we'll probably end up uh, doing all of our shenanigans, getting ourselves to Lily Cove. 
um, and definitely beating up the, the sixth gym leader, I think it is. So if you guys have enjoyed this episode, please do leave a rating and a comment. Don't forget to answer the question of the video for this video, and I will see you guys next time.